10 facts on aerobic respiration just to help you focus your revision of this very important topic. Remember, these videos never replace using your textbook or doing past examination questions. And remember, there are more detailed videos on this topic if that's how you choose to study. So fact number one, the definition. Aerobic respiration is the enzyme controlled release of energy from food using oxygen. Fact number two, there's an equation that you must know and it must be balanced perfectly. Fact three, aerobic respiration is a two stage process. It's made up of glycolysis stage one and Krebs cycle stage two. Fact four, glycolysis is stage one and oxygen plays no part in this process. Glycolysis takes place in the cytosol of the cells, which is the liquid part of the cytoplasm. Fact five, the products of glycolysis are ATP, only a net gain of two ATP molecules, two molecules of pyruvate or pyruvic acid, and two NADH molecules. Fact six, stage two can only occur if oxygen is present. It takes place in the mitochondria of the cells and Krebs cycle is this series of reactions in stage two and it's sometimes called the citric acid cycle. Fact seven, stage two begins with pyruvic acid or pyruvate molecules moving from the cytosol into the mitochondria and immediately being transformed into a two carbon molecule called acetyl coenzyme A. Fact eight, the products of Krebs cycle are carbon dioxide, ATP, not very much of it, one per cycle, but many NADH molecules. Fact nine, NADH transfers high energy electrons to an electron transport chain, and these are located on the inner membranes of the mitochondria. Once this transfer of electrons and the proton takes place, NAD plus is recycled, and that's really important. Fact 10, the electrons that have been transferred, they pass over electron transport chains, losing energy, and this energy is then used to make ATP. The electrons then combine with oxygen and protons to form water.